With so much focus on our physical health right now, it's easy to forget about our mental health. Rebecca Ridley is getting answers from a doctor in Monroe about how we can manage the stress. During the pandemic, it's normal to feel more anxious than usual, but there are some things that we can be doing to keep our minds busy. We're joined right now by Dr. Jennifer Salino Folks from Monroe Clinic. Jennifer, feelings of stress and anxiety are expected during something like the COVID-19 outbreak. Absolutely. Um, we are all trying to navigate this together. And so extending ourselves and each other a little grace and understanding is going to be really important, knowing that we're all kind of uh, getting our sea legs again and trying to find what our normal for this period of time is going to be. And teens and children might express their stress or anxiety different than adults do. What do parents need to be looking out for? For all of us, but especially children under periods of stress, people revert back to behaviors that um, they had once kind of conquered. So um, any kind of um, toileting accidents or bedwetting or anything like that should be looked into and discussed in a way that um, is compassionate and um, kind of a, a, a more gentle approach rather than something that is um, wrong or um, met with some punishment. Um, so I think the irritable irritability, the acting out, crying, um, reverting back to behaviors are some things that really parents um, should keep an eyeball out for. This is a lonely time for many of us, but your group put together a list of different ways that we can keep our minds going. Talk about some of the suggestions. Online, first of all, we talk about um, podcasts, um, things like Zoom and, and Marco Polo that we can um, reach out to three people every day on. The Smithsonian Museum or the Natural History Museum all have tours online. Uh, and one of my favorites is um, downloading Mad Libs. Uh, that's a fun, friendly activity that you can do with kids or adults that's just good for some levity and um, it, it cracks everybody up. Okay, Jennifer, thank you so much for speaking with us and giving You're us welcome. those great suggestions. We'll put a link to all of those over on our website, wkow.com.